Jess, come and guess with me. When the sun is shining and it's time to start the day, who knows what we will find as we travel on the way? We're gonna guess, 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 guess with Jess. We're gonna guess, guess, guess with Jess. We're gonna put it to the test. Guess with Jess. We're gonna try our best and guess with Jess. We can do it. Lettuces and carrots. Look, there. Willow will love these. See you later, Jess. Mimi always shares everything, and she's amazing at growing things. So let me tell you about the time that we decided to grow something for Mimi. It all started at Buttercup Meadow. Growing something for Mimi? Great idea! Let's grow something that Mimi doesn't already grow. Then it'll be a surprise. Hmm. Beans! I've never seen those growing at Mimi's. Beans grow on a beanstalk. That'd be a brilliant thing to grow. Yes! So, what do we need? I can try. We're planning a surprise for Mimi. How do we grow beans on a beanstalk? That's easy. The first thing you need is a seed, a bean seed. Yay! Why? <laughs> <laughs> because you can't grow anything without a seed. Look, I had some beans in my breakfast bucket this morning. You can have one of them. Wow! Thanks, Willow. Here, let's have this one. <gasps> that is one beautiful bean. All you have to do is plant it in soil in a pot. Soil? That's right. Plants grow in soil. Look. Like these marigolds. The roots will grow down and the beanstalk will grow up. Wow! So that's how a seed grows into a plant. Thanks, Willow. Brilliant! Here's a good pot for planting our bean. Thanks, Billy. Now we've got the bean and the pot. What else do we need to plant a bean? Can you remember? Is it a leaf, a stone or some soil? Let's make a little space for the bean. Snuggle in, little bean. Wait a minute. It's a surprise for Mimi, so we should hide it. Why not here, in the potting shed? No, it needs to be somewhere Mimi won't look. Willow stable. We can hide it there. Come on. Once we'd hidden our pot, we waited for our bean to grow. We waited and waited. <laughs>
ask Willow why, because she'd gone away. And Horace didn't know anything about growing things. But then I had an idea. <sighs> I know! Let's go and look at Mimi's garden. Maybe it'll give us an idea about how to grow things. Right. Great idea, Jess. Everything's growing. What's making it all grow? So we went back to the stable and watered our bean. And in a few days' time, guess what happened? A little shoot popped out of the soil and grew. And a few days later, other leaves grew on either side of it. And then it grew taller and taller. And then it started to go all yellow and wilty. We'll have to go and ask Mimi for help. But it's meant to be a surprise for Mimi. So, we'll have to do it without her guessing why. Come on, let's go. Hello, Mimi. Your garden's great. Nothing yellow and wilty here at all. Of course not. All my plants get plenty of water and sunlight. <gasps> sunlight! sunlight. Yes, the sun gives plants all the light and warmth they need. Light and warmth! <laughs> Bye! I wonder what they're up to. So now we knew what we needed to grow a beanstalk. It needed to be somewhere sunny and warm. But we also wanted it to be somewhere Mimi wouldn't see it. Can you guess the best place? Inside my barn, inside the potting shed, or outside in the orchard? Outside in the orchard! That's right! So we stood it in the orchard and day by day it grew and grew. And then lovely red flowers appeared. And after the flowers, the beans came and got bigger and bigger and bigger until at last, we've done it! The bee needed water and sunshine to grow. We've got the answer! Yippity-yay, yippity-yay, yippity-yay! Something for you. Hello, I'm back. What a beautiful beanstalk. It is. And it's covered in beans. So guess what we're all having for dinner? Beans! beans. <laughs> <laughs> so we all had yummy beans for dinner. Why don't you see if you can grow something to eat too? And don't forget, sunshine and water. <laughs> Come and help me answer another question soon. Bye!
going to play with the others. Do you want to come? Where is everyone? Joey! Jinx! Billy! Ma? Mimi? No one's here. Maybe they're hiding. Aha! Billy could fit in a teeny tiny hole like this. Billy! No. Oh! Hello, Hedgehog. Wow, you're thirsty. <laughs> That's funny. Willow told me hedgehogs usually only come out at night. Scary! Hey! <laughs> there you are. I've been looking for you. Do you want to play scary steps, Jack? Oh, yes, please. Do you want to play hedgehog? 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 Are you all right? Hmm. He's all curled up. But why? Why is Hedgehog curled up in a ball? Hey! That's the big question! Ask a lot of what? 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 Ask it to sit, find a way! Yes, we just, come on, let's play! What's the question here today? Why is Hedgehog curled up in a ball? Maybe he's playing a game. A curling up in a ball game. Let's play too. <laughs> it's too hard. I'd rather play scary steps. Me too. <laughs> Maybe he wants to play our game. Let's play scary steps and then he might uncurl and join in. Yeah! Good idea! OK, Hedgehog, this is how you play. I close my eyes and Jinx hides. Now I find her. One scary step, two scary steps, three scary steps. Scary! Ah! <laughs> 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 He's still all curled up. He definitely doesn't want to play. We do. Where's the best place to play scary steps? Somewhere with lots of trees to hide behind. The whispering woods. Right. I'll come and play when I found out why hedgehogs all curled up. Thanks, Jess. See you later. Bye. <laughs> I wonder what these twigs and leaves are doing here. I know. You're moving house, hedgehog. Willow told me that hedgehogs collect twigs and leaves at this time of year to help build their nests. We saw a little hole that would make a good home for someone small, didn't we? Where was it? By the pond? On the path? Or under the twisty tree? Under the twisty tree! That's right! Hedgehog? If I help you move house, will you uncurl for me? Hey, you've uncurled. That's great. It's much easier to move house when you're not curled up in a ball. Come on. I bet you curled up in a ball. Because you wanted me to help you. That must be the answer to the question. Yippity yay, yippity yay! Yippity. <laughs> Hello, you two. Are you coming to play scary steps in the Whispering Woods? Yes, but I'm helping Hedgehog move house first. Oh, not again. Why is he rolled up in a ball? I don't know. I thought he did it because he wanted me to help him, but I have helped him. And he's done it again. He could just be asleep. <gasps> of course, Billy. Willow told me that hedgehogs usually sleep in the daytime. And this is day. Maybe we should stick 
tickle him with a leaf to wake him. I don't think he'd like that, Billy. Hmm, maybe not. But I know who will. <laughs> we should leave him alone now so he can have his nap. Come on, Jess. We can play scary steps while Hedgehog's sleeping. I will, after I've answered the big question. Hedgehog, you're not having a nap. So if you don't curl up in a ball to nap, why do you curl up? Hmm. Scary! <laughs> Hello, Mimi. Are you coming to play scary steps? Yes, but I've got to answer the big question first. Oh, look, he's done it again. Look at all his funny spikes. I'd rather have nice warm fur. <gasps> Mimi, that might be the answer. Maybe he's rolling up into a ball to keep warm. Brilliant. Are you coming to play scary steps now then? Well, I'd like to, but I'm not sure I've quite answered the question. He might be cold, but it doesn't feel that cold today. I tell you what, I'll go and get everyone to come and play scary steps here. Then you can watch Hedgehog while we play. I'll be right back. Thanks, Mimi. <gasps> you uncurled again. Maybe you're not cold. Maybe you're too hot. I know what will cool you down. A nice drink of water. Where can we get some water for Hedgehog to drink? We saw him drinking there earlier. Was it at the puddle? At my barn? Or at Mimi's hut? At the puddle! That's right! Come on! Hedgehog? That's it! I saw him curl up when you shouted scary. And, and now I think about it, every time someone shouted scary, Hedgehog curled up in a ball. Don't be scared, Hedgehog. We're very sorry for scaring you. Yes, sorry, yes, Hedgehog. Sorry. Hello. You've uncurled. And we've answered the big question. Yippity yay, yippity yay! Oops. Sorry, Hedgehog. <laughs> yippity yay, yippity yay, yippity yay! curled up in a ball because he was scared. Sleep well, Hedgehog. See if you can spot Hedgehog out at night. But he's very, very shy, so be careful not to scare him. Come and help me answer another question soon. <laughs>